What up, everybody? Yeah, it's nice to see ya. I gotta play your review on Wilfred Zaha. I hope he's better than the storyline of last year. So let's put him in the team and give you something to cheer for. What up, everybody? It's Noobie, and welcome back to a brand new FIFA 21 player review. It's rewards day, and I got absolutely nothing in my rivals rewards nor in my weekend league rewards. My player picks were terrible, with an 81 rated goalie as the highest rated, instead of the main man of this episode, Wilfred Zaha. His red version would fit my team perfectly, but yeah, did I get him? So instead of that, we're gonna buy him off the transfer market and see how he performs. Before we start though, if you're new to the channel, if you enjoy this episode, please smash that like button and that subscribe button to help the channel grow to 1000 subs. All right guys, let's do this shit. Hey yo, doobie, Zaha got more skills than you, bro. When are you getting five star, five star? Come on, God. So first things first, Wilfred Zaha. 5'11", medium medium work rate isn't ideal, right footed, 5 star skill moves is of course perfect, 3 star weak foot is a little bit... <laughs> Taking a look at the pace, we see a phenomenal 92 pace with 90 acceleration and 94 sprint speed. His dribbling is a little bit out of balance, he does have 89 agility but 81 balance and 82 composure. 77 reactions is also not that great but he does have 88 ball control and 92 dribbling. So I don't know if he will be fast in game or maybe feel a little bit on the slow side. His shooting is also average with 79 attack positioning, 80 finishing, 84 shot power and that long shots is terrible with 73. So definitely don't shoot from outside the box, get inside the box, close one on one with the goalie and shoot in goal. His physicals are also average with 79 strength, 74 aggression and 70 stamina. Fuck that shit. So basically what stands out for this card is his 5 star skill moves and that 92 pace that's why he's worth 200k so for a camp style I would definitely drop a finisher camp style on him boost that dribbling and boost that shooting if you have him on 10 cam you will get 95 finishing and 89 attack and positioning. For trades, he only has the flare trade, so no finesse shot trade and no outside of the foot shot trade. So basically, he has that three star weak foot, which isn't ideal. So, this is the team that I will play Zahain. I have a little hybrid between La Liga and Premier League up front Iñaki Williams and Zaha. Left mid, Ansu Fati and Frankie de Jong. Havertz and Salah will be the right mid. Yuri, Nacho Fernandez, Thiago Silva, Pereira in defense, and Ter Stegen in goal. What time is it? Game time! Havertz with the ball on to Mo Salah. Back to Havertz. Look at that strength, beautiful. On to Wilfred Zaha. Ooh, loses the possession. Salah on to Havertz. Salah's making a run. Gets the ball. He has some space now on the flank. Zaha's making a run. Ooh, that was not a good cross. Mo Salah, there he goes again on that wing. Back to Havertz, nice through ball onto Zaha, but he loses the ball again. And we have to defend. There we go, Frankie de Jong with the interception, beautiful. Havertz, see if we can use advantage here. Come on Havertz, yes, good strength. Salah on that wing, with a pass, Zaha. With a through ball, there we go. Beautiful assist from Wilfred Zaha, Inyaki Williams with the tap in. In the lead, 1-0, let's go. Salah, Salah, on that wing again. Inyaki Williams, can't get the ball to Zaha, now he can. Zaha, ay, ay, ay. I don't know, man, he gets blocked every time. This half was boring, yo. Zero shots for him, one shot for me. Horrible. Salah gets the ball, Taliska, with a nice heel to heel. And some skill moves, and the pass. On to Neymar with the shot. Come on, get that interception, boys. Oh, it's a little bit through. Salah. Salah can get the ball. And Sufati can get the ball back. Nice. Neymar. Neymar on to Zaha. Zaha. What is wrong with my Zaha? I'm spamming L2, but he still cannot hold the ball. Frankie. On to Taliska. Taliska with a beautiful turn. Now in some space with the pass. Zaha. Back to Neymar, Neymar wants to give it to Zaha, Zaha skill move, again he gets easily pushed off that ball, oh he's through, he's through, watch out for the sweaty pass, ay ay ay, one all, he's back in the match, 
Hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. Ansu Fati. Ansu Fati with space on the wing. There goes Neymar. Neymar with the run and the turn. And the pass onto Wilfred Zaha. Zaha finally some space. Good skill move. There we go. What a beautiful finish. Low driven in that bottom right corner. If he has space, then he can perform. Nice goal by Wilfred Zaha. 2 1 up. Neymar. Neymar making a run with a nice rainbow flick and the pass onto Ansu Fati. Wilfred Zaha, heel the heel. It's a good elastico. He's through the pass. Ah, almost the second assist for Zaha. All right, guys, I think that's it. 2 1 victory. Beautiful. Give me a C. Give me an H. Give me an AMP. What's that spell? Everybody, champ. Oh, Mura. Oh, you got space with Vardy. Come on, defend. Thiago Silva. Ay, yeah, yeah. That's the thing. When Thiago Silva puts that L2 in, Vardy just keeps going. And when I have the ball with Zaha, he flies off the ball. Salah. Nice use of strength there. Onto Wilfred Zaha. Whoa. Whoa, that fake shot was all the way back to the middle line, man. Come on. Where's your subtlety, Zaha? Onto Williams. Havertz with the moves. Looking for Zaha, can't find him. Frankie de Jong. Havertz. Let's create some space there. There we go. Williams. Zaha. Ah, again, what a horrible skill move. Zaha. That's good, Elastico. Now space and a shot. Ooh. Saved by the goalie. There's Stegen with the throw onto Pereira. Salah's making a run on that wing. Salah is through. Where's backup? Nobody far post. Salah, you're on your own with the pass. Zaha. Zaha, come on, man. Loses the ball yet again. Frankie. With a good ball roll around that sliding tackle. Ansu Fati is through. Ansu Fati, can we get the pass onto Zaha? Ah, we cannot. We cannot get that pass. Frankie, back to Havertz. On to Zaha. Zaha with space. Zaha with the shot. Left foot. Oof. That's that weak foot. Zaha with the fake shot. And get stopped by the defender. Still possible. No pass. Shot. Ah. What is going on, man? What is going on? <laughs> Let's go. Frankie. Donde esta Frankie? Oh, he's playing around good. Ooh, that's a great interception from Nacho Fernandez. Now we have time for the counter. Ansu Fati with a beautiful turn. Neymar's making a run. Neymar gets that ball. Neymar. Neymar far post. There we go. What a beautiful counter. Love it. Neymar with a beautiful finish as well. 1 0. Back in the match, boys. Oh, he goes with the short corner. Shot block. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me, man. After all that hard work, that is how he scores. That is a horrible 2 1. Come on. Defend, boys. Defend. Oh, he's through with that promise. Yep, there's three defenders there, but still he gets that ball to Lucas Maura. 3-1. Can uh, I cannot deny, I'm pretty salty still from that goal. Very salty. <coughs> Neymar. With the pass onto Frankie. Taliska's making a run in the center, gets the ball. Plays it off to Zaha, empty goal. Long shot. All right, do we still have time? Injury time. Is he gonna be like that? Is he gonna run all the way back? All right, we still have time, come on. Interception. Now is the time to shine, boys. Taliska with the pass onto Neymar. Neymar, heal the heal. Neymar with space. Ay, ay, ay. What a slide tackle by him. Oh my God. That was a good slide tackle. Losing the match, 3-2. Hi guys, I played a few matches with Zahab and I don't know about this card, I was struggling. 
Rivals matches are pretty sweaty at the moment and I could not create any chances with Zaha like I can with a Neymar or that other inform card of Timo Werner. For some reason Zaha is pretty easy to defend. I cannot really hold the ball with him so if I have to choose between him and Timo Werner 10 out of 10 I would choose Werner. Zaha does have 5 star skill moves but he's lacking strength and that attack and positioning. He cannot really create an opportunity for himself, he really needs space before he can perform. So yeah, I don't know what it is but I didn't really enjoy playing with Zaha like I did with his storyline card of last year. So he won't be getting in my weekend league team and I don't think he's worth that 220 or 250k at the moment. Alright guys, this was it for this episode. Hopefully you enjoyed it, hopefully it was helpful. Leave a like, a comment, subscribe to the channel and I'll see you guys in the next vid. Later!